Look at this. Do you see my eye? Listen, I woke up this morning feeling nice. I took a nice hot shower. I decided to wear contacts today. I put the right one in, fine. I was gonna put the second one in, but realized there was no more solution in that container. So my contact was dried out. So I'm like, fuck, okay. So then let me just wear my glasses. I'm trying to take my motherfucking contact out. I could not take it out. I did not cut my nails. Look at how long they are. So I was literally scratching at my eye trying to get that fucking contact out. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna start my day. I'm gonna get out of this hotel and head over to somewhere very nice. Love it. Look at this. Look at that. I'm just showing you what you could be experiencing if y'all just leave your area and try something different, something new. Ugh. We're missing out on a lot of things because we choose to not change our environment, our surroundings, our work. It's okay for a little bit of change. A little bit of change every now and then will help you mentally. That. Mm -hmm. The painting, the colors. So serene. The deck, the decor. Come on. Let's go here. They offer a 24-hour gym with a yoga studio. I can't get enough of the decor. Look how pretty this. Look at this stuff. I'm feeling everything right now. Lunch, learn, lounge. Pedal, play, pour. So let's go ahead and head over to the gym just to see how everything is. You know I won't be working out, as you already know. But I still want to see lockers, restrooms. Run, restore, relax. As you can see, I'm not the only one that does not want to work out. Wow, it's nice though, I'm not gonna lie to you. Just looking at this makes me want to work out. It's 24 hours, you can come any time of the day. More towels, complimentary for the swimming pool. Yes, you heard me right, the swimming pool. I'm from the Midwest, okay, Chicago. And it is too cold to be in a swimming pool out there. They have a jacuzzi somewhere, I don't know where. But let's go back inside and I'm gonna show you the commons area. Because it's CBD. Gotcha. Gotcha. Thank you. They have little snacks. And all this stuff is for everyone to, to grab. Coffee is complimentary. Feel free to use these coffee mugs. Okay, I'm going to get out of here. I just wanted to show you the hotel real quick. 
I'm probably gonna get a drink at the bar there in the commons and hang out on that hammock because that hammock is so comfortable. Oh my God. I wish I could put that in our house, like in the basement somewhere. I don't know if we're allowed to like have stuff like that hang from the ceiling. Hey. <laughs> What's your name? Oh, Lily? Lily. Lily. <laughs> so I'm on a shuttle right now. We're on our way to Seven Falls. So I'm planning on seeing some beautiful waterfalls. Waterfalls. Excited. <laughs> it's not necessarily a hike. Um, I'm doing a hike tomorrow actually, but I'm doing a point eight walk up to the waterfalls. It's called uh, the Broadmoor Seven Falls. They give me a little map to follow if I choose to. And I'm so upset I couldn't bring Gizmo. I really wanted to bring him because everyone has their dogs. Look at this big fella. Hi, I miss my dog. I haven't taken him on a little hike. I feel like such a bad parent. I could have taken that ride up here, but it's only for two more dollars. But what's the point? You gotta experience everything by foot. I'm gonna lie to you, this little curve over here. Yeah, they may have that little mirror for cars to look out for when they do this turn. But when a car comes here, or there, they don't see my ass. I'm gonna die today. And I ain't trying to die. I might be depressed and everything, but I ain't suicidal like that, okay? Oh, shit. Let me leave my footprints. Okay. All right. Wow, it's pretty. They have a little bit of snow. Oh wow. Okay, so we have to be careful here because it looks like it's a little icy. A little icy. Who said Colorado ain't a place to go to? You're missing out if you think Colorado ain't a spot to hit in the US. Hold on a second. What you mean? Please use bear proof trash containers for refuse. What the fuck? Are you telling me that there's bears out here? And I'm by myself. And animals always attack their prey when they're by themselves. Yeah. Um, let me keep walking. Uh-uh, y'all better not fall on me. Y'all better not fall on me. Hi. So, that mountain elevator, that mountain elevator takes me to the same place this does? Correct. And then the other set of stairs just to the left of the restaurant. Oh, is that where the waterfalls are going to be? Yes. Okay, so I'll just use this elevator for here, and then I'll walk that. <laughs> Thank you. Uh -uh, I ain't walking up two flights of stairs, no way. I'll just do one set. One set's good enough for me. So, I'm gonna take the mountain elevator. Ooh. Hold on, what this is? It's dark in here, but I purposely brought this camera because it lights up even in the dark. So I don't need extra, extra lighting and I'm good to go. This is the history and you have to respect all Native Americans. This was their land before it was ours. They lived their life mostly as it is 
as how nature wanted it to be. We kind of fucked everything up. It's okay though, you know what I'm saying? We have to, we have to follow along with the changes. <laughs> right now, I am on my way up to Eagle's Nest. Take this elevator up. Mmm, that looks scary. Okay. Oh shit. Alright, okay, okay. Ooh. And I'm here by myself. Yes. But look at the view that I have. This is surely and most definitely from the view of an eagle. Wow. If this doesn't take your breath away, I don't know what does. The driver from the shuttle bus actually told us that this is perfect timing to come. It's less people. The weather is like perfect, not too hot, not too cold. So I don't know, man, God told me to come. I came. Oh shit, that's the stairs. Hold on, let me show y'all. The reason why I'm here is to see the falls. So I am going up those steps all the way. All, oh, I ain't done, I ain't done. All the way up there. That's where I'm going. I mean, I don't have to. I can just see the falls from here. It's beautiful. It's amazing. I can just see it from here. Come on, you gotta do something different. You gotta experience it. You have to. This, this fucker took my quarters. Didn't even work. Look at those minerals. They're so pretty. Actually, you know what? There's an employee in there, it might be open. Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm good. I didn't see you in there. This is so pretty. Warm up? Yeah, it's not, it's not that bad. I'm good. Yeah, it's good weather. I got my bag full of goodies. Wish that could be me. Wish that could be me and my wife, but... I had to do the trip alone. By the way, my wife is perfectly fine with me coming by myself. She knows where my mental state is and she knows that I need this. So your partner has to be supportive in the things that you choose to do to make yourself better, to make yourself feel better. This is the bottom of the falls. I could literally just sit here. Oh, it's a rocking chair. <laughs> it's a rocking chair. Yay. <laughs> I love rocking chairs. That is my view. I don't know why it's called Seven Falls, but it's very pretty. I'll be going up there soon, y'all. How was it? Oh, it was nice. I said I didn't care I can't hear you. I'm talking to you. I just got bad news. All right, let's take this journey. It's so much more colder here. And it's, I'm sure it's going to get even colder once I get up there, so... I had to put this little guy on. Woo, here we go. Oh my gosh. I brought water with me, so I'm still safe. No joke. Oh my gosh. That's, I don't know what to say about that experience. I could not breathe. I think I was about to have an anxiety attack. Felt like it at least. I could not breathe. It's 
never a good sign when you see fire danger, warning. Icy. This path is way too icy for me to go on. I can't do it guys, sorry. My leg, my shoes are too, are too smooth for this type of trail. Can't do it. If you haven't worked out and you're on your way to Colorado, you're fucked. Look at my legs. They're <laughs> well, you can't tell, but they're shaky. So I'm gonna go ahead and get into this restaurant called 1858. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be pricey because it is in a tourist area. But that's all right. I'm gonna treat myself for a nice dinner. Why not? I think I deserve it. They call this restaurant 1858 because gold was discovered in the Colorado Territory in 1858. So, sounds like a perfect name for it. Oh wow. <laughs> That's nice. Do I just sit anywhere or it's just me by myself? Do you want a table? Do you want to be in the bar? Um, I'll be at a table. Yeah, it should be you fine. Like to sit in the back. Yeah, it was. Yeah, let's yeah. go back there. Thank you. What was that? It's cooler up here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to warm up. Oh, perfect. Yes, thank you. So do you have any allergies to food? I'm allergic to shrimp. To shrimp, okay. Yes. Delicious that bowl was uh, To die for it was a $20 meal, which is understandable. I left a $10 tip because she was great She did her job perfectly good. So So let me see what I'm gonna get my family because I'm getting all the baby kids something from here Guess who's going into a jacuzzi? When it's like 55 degrees outside this bitch right here. It's a jacuzzi, it's 102 degrees in there. Why not? I'm most likely gonna be the only one in there too. Cause yesterday nobody was there. Today I don't see nobody in there, so. Let me get one of these towels. Oh yeah, so you already know how the swimming pool looks like. Apparently, the jacuzzi is right here in the corner. <laughs> I am living life right now. I have the whole jacuzzi to myself. If I want to, I could swim in that swimming pool right now. I'm literally by myself. See? I was not lying. Alright. Let's not drop the phone, Carol. Let's not drop the motherfucking phone. Okay, so the weather here in Colorado Springs is 52 degrees. A lot better than Chicago. Still a little chilly, but I do not feel it. Like even right now, even with my lower body in the water, up here you would think I'm cold, I'm not. The steam just warms you up. It's so perfect. Hello. Hi. I must get a see some baby back here. <laughs> it's dark over here, I don't know why. There should be some lighting back here, but. <laughs> I spent a good hour in that hot tub, 
but I did not want to be selfish. I did not want to just hog the hot tub because there were some people that wanted to get in there. So I just went ahead and just left, but it was a great hour. Oh my God, a great hour that I needed. But I'm here in my room now. I'm gonna actually get some sleep because tomorrow I have a long day. So stay tuned for that. But before I leave y'all, I wrote a quote on the chalkboard and I want everyone who is suffering, I don't wanna say suffering, but who is battling from depression or anxiety, I want you to know that there's hope. Life does get better. So I want to leave this quote with you guys. Character cannot be developed in ease and quiet. Only through experience of trial and suffering can the soul be strengthened, ambition inspired, and success achieved. That quote is by Helen Keller. Stay strong, stay motivated, keep your loved ones around. Always have something, always have a goal something to look forward to because that will help. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm actually going to edit it right now as I lay in bed. You see my computer's already ready, good to go. And I will see you tomorrow. See y'all later.